you know, the process is just a definition of what you have to do to accomplish a goal. But then you have to have the discipline to execute it every day. All right, so first of all, you get everybody to buy in to climb the mountain all right, and do all the things that they have to do to be the best that they can be. You know, that's special. And then to be able to continue that. You know, people don't understand, you know, success is not a continuum. Just because you were successful doesn't mean you're going to continue to be successful. you got to understand that you always need to try to improve and get better. And you need to continue to do the things that helped you be successful to start with. I know this never gets old for you, but uh, why? why? Why do you do what you do? Are you driven to be the best at what you do? Yes, sir. You know, there's an old Martin Luther King sermon that, you know, talks about there's only one guy that I'd let shine my shoes in Montgomery, Alabama because of the pride he had in the performance of how he shined my shoes. I didn't want anybody else in the world to shine my shoes. And the enjoyment he got that he did a great job for what you did. And you've probably heard this sermon, and I'm, I'm just paraphrasing here, but if you're going to be a street sweeper, be the best street sweeper you can be. Sweep the streets like Michelangelo painted a Sistine Chapel, like Shakespeare wrote literature. Let him put a sign up right here that says the best street sweeper in the world lives right here. And if you can do that, you do the best there, you, you, you do the best there is in life knowing you did your best to be the best you could be no matter what you choose to do. That's why. Because there's no better feeling than knowing you did the best you could be. I don't care if it's what you do, what I do, what the street sweeper does. It really doesn't matter. It's not all about results.